Oh boy, studying the Bible, studying the Bible. I'm so excited about speaking on Sunday. You're not. You're not teaching on Sunday. I meant speaking to my friends. Uh, why are you so excited about that? Because they're really cool and sometimes they like talk back to me. Sometimes your friends don't talk back to you? Well, if they didn't hear me, then they usually. That doesn't make sense, dude. If I whisper, why are you whispering to your friends? Okay. I'm going to have to be Captain Obvious here, but have you ever thought about the fact that I might be training to be a dog whisperer? I'm going to put money down that you don't know what a dog whisperer is. Somebody who talks to dead dogs. That's gross. Oh, yeah. No. Okay, like the ghosts of dead dogs. What do you think ghost dogs would have to say to you, buddy? Well, like, hey, buddy, I'm in heaven now. Hey, I'm licking an angel. <laughs> Like that. I can't believe we're talking about ghost dogs licking angels. <laughs> I know. It gives me a great idea on what to teach about on Sunday, though. No, you're not. You're not teaching on Sunday. Fine. But I'm still going to be a dog whisperer. And you can't do anything about it, David Penuel. Okay, good luck with that. I don't need luck. I got the Bible. It's not going to help. It's truth. <laughs> it has nothing to do with truth in the word dog whispering faith above <laughs> Luke 16:21 even the dogs came and licked his sores in your face Wikipedia, dog whisperer, a person who plays a role in rehabilitating and restoring balance. I hit that really hard. It's my laptop. 